you are watching Redicon. Next, I'm going to talk about TFCC, which is a complex of uh, different structures. Uh, this TFCC is a fiber cartilage complex which transmits load between the carpus and the ulna, and it stabilizes the ulna aspect of the carpus. So, different components of TFCC are TFC disc, which is a bow tie shaped structure, meniscal homolog, ulno lunate and ulno tricuteral ligaments, volar and dorsal radio ulna ligaments and ulnar collateral ligament and ECU or extensor carpal narus tendon sheath. So here is an example of a TFC disc which is a bow tie shaped structure. Uh, it has a proximal lamina which inserts onto the uh, um, ulna and it has a distal lamina which almost inserts onto the ulnar stoloid process and in between uh, this area is called ligamentum subcreantum and it is of slightly intermediate to high signal intensity, so please don't confuse it with the tear. Uh, it's a normal uh, sort of like signal uh, change in that region, which is seen in almost all cases. On the radial side, the TFC disc attaches onto the hyaline cartilage, so uh, d uh, this intermediate signal between the uh, cortex of the uh, radius and between the radial side of the TFC disc is just uh, cartilage and it's not a tear and that's also a normal appearance of it. Meniscal homolog is between the entrance to the pre recess and extensor carpal narus tendon and it divides into fibrous and vascular parts. Uh, so that's the fibrous part and that's the vascular part which is a bit more hyper intense and it attaches to the ulnar toilet process. Ulnar collateral ligament, it blends with the extensor carpal narus tendon hamate and fifth metacarpal base. So uh, it, it's, it's a thin structure and can be difficult to uh, separate from the extensor carpal narus tendon which is here and then it, some of his fibers attaches onto the hook of the hamate, uh, sorry uh, on the lat uh, other side of the hamate uh, and other side of the tricuteum here. There are different reasons for TFC pathology. It's either due to acute trauma or due to chronic repetitive microtrauma and elongated ulna. Uh, coronal 3D sequences are quite good looking at a TFCC uh, or if you have the facilities available, uh, then direct MR arthrography is considered gold standard to assess uh, for TFCC pathology. Palmer classification is well recognized uh, uh, type uh, of classification you can use for TFCC injuries, so type 1 or class 1 is traumatic and different grades are uh, class 1A is central perforation, B is ulnar evulsion with or without distal ulnar fracture, uh, 1C is distal evulsion, uh, 1D is radial evulsion with or without sigmoid notch fracture. And type 2 is degenerative, so it starts with mild wear and tear and then it progresses uh, further uh, towards chondromalacia with perforation and with further injuries to the linotricuteral ligament and uh, ongoing uh, allocarpal and radio arthritis. This video is presented in collaboration with Radicon Institute of Radiology. You are welcome to subscribe to our YouTube channel and click on the notification bell for updates. For more modules in radiology CMEs, please visit our website www.radicon.org.